Thanks for listening to the podcast today. And in this episode, we'll discuss tips to find a good Medicare approved home health care agency. At some point in life, many seniors will be faced with a complex decision about their ongoing health care. Acute and chronic medical conditions, as well as post-surgical periods, inevitably creep into our lives via the aging process. Part of our health care needs may at one time or another, they'll include rehabilitation or recovery. To minimize confusion, let's define home health care. The overall goals of home health care services are to help clients restore function in their lives after illness or injury in the comfort of their own home. Hospice or palliative care is not necessarily included in this umbrella of services since the goal is to provide quality of life for end-of-life situations such as terminal illness. Medical and rehabilitative staff may schedule appearances in their client's home and carry out a methodically developed treatment plan. Home health services provide multiple forms of medical and rehabilitative care depending on what clients are in need of. Clients and caregivers can take proactive steps to ensure they are getting the care that they require before home health employees walk through their door. And here are seven tips for finding high quality home health care agencies that suit your needs. Number one, conduct your own research. While patients are in the hospital and are preparing for discharge, medical staff will usually recommend home health care services when and where appropriate. Additionally, some hospitals will offer patients home health care agencies information and go as far as setting up services at home before the patient even leaves the hospital. This is meant to add convenience to the transition home for recovery. However, patients and their family members and caregivers are welcome to perform their own research pertaining to home health care agencies available to them in their residential area. More than likely, each agency will have a website, email, and phone number available to set up consults and to provide information about their company and services. Number two, examine your insurance and finances first before reaching out to a home health care agency. Amongst the listed research items should be health insurance coverage. Patients should inquire about what insurance plans home health agencies will accept first. This includes the amount of coverage for what specific services and what duration. Service duration is often determined by the type of medical condition or conditions the client has. But financially speaking, it is health insurance that is the main contributor. Number three, get a feel for communication style and effectiveness. When talking to representatives and employees of prospective home health care agencies, take note of how well they communicate with potential clients. What is their style? Do they primarily communicate through email, phone calls, or text? Are they readily available during the day if needed? If you have to leave a message, do they respond in a timely manner? Aside from basic customer service manners, Think about how employees will communicate with clients in their homes about their medical needs. Will staff provide a heads up to the best of their abilities if appointments are canceled or postponed? How well do employees communicate across disciplines? For example, the doctors, nurses, CNAs, therapists, etc. To make sure that the client is on the same treatment plan. Number four. Observe rapport building strategies. Consider how well medical staff make attempts to creating healthy relationships with their clients. One simple way agencies can do this is to send in the same employee over and over again for each individual service. This provides clients with consistency. It also gives them the opportunity to develop trust and appropriate friendships with staff members. On the other hand, if there's a clash between employees and clients, assess whether or not the agency is quick to address these issues and possibly switch out the employee. Number five, assess the individual medical conditions 
to determine what you will actually need from a home health care agency. As a potential client, what do you actually need from a Medicare-approved home health care agency? If coming home directly from the hospital, your primary physician may have already made recommendations for the type of services you require. The goal of home health is to provide specific care at home in order to help the client make a full recovery so as to function as safely and independently as possible. Depending on the hospitalization, recovery plans will look different for each client. If someone is recovering from a total hip replacement, the doctor may require occupational therapy, physical therapy, and nursing services at home. If another patient is sent home for a bout of acute illness resulting in respiratory failure, the doctor may recommend similar services as well as respiratory services and relevant equipment like O2 tanks, ventilators, CPAPs, etc. Number six, analyze all of the services available by the home health care agency. In the United States, Medicare approved home health care agency services are almost universal. Services frequently include nursing, home health aides, in home doctor's visits, social services, respiratory care, transportation, rehabilitative services, physical, occupational, and speech therapy, pharmaceutical services, in home lab and x ray visits, nutritional care and volunteer care. It never hurts to double check which services are actually available to clients through prospective agencies. Many senior clients will not necessarily require all medical or rehabilitative services available. As mentioned previously, primary physicians will aid in developing a plan of care that includes services relevant to the client's needs. And lastly, number seven, what is the hiring process and criteria for employees at the home health care agency you want to hire? For security and safety reasons, many seniors and caregivers would like to know who is actually coming into their home. Consult with home health care agencies to determine what the hiring process is like for a new employee, including qualifications, screening process, and background checks. Learn about company policy pertaining to dress requirements, such as uniforms and name tags, so to prevent complete strangers from entering the home. On top of managing new illnesses, surgical operations, or injuries, finding a home healthcare agency can be an intimidating ordeal for the first-time clients and caregivers. More than likely, if you're discharging home from a hospital setting, the majority of those affairs associated with your home health care plan will be recommended or set up by the hospital staff prior to you leaving. If you prefer to have more control over your home health care plan, feel free to use our suggested tips to get started. Thanks again for listening to the podcast today. And if you'd like more great information about senior care, subscribe to this podcast and visit Senior Home Care hq.com once again that senior s e n i o r home care hq.com